Alright, hi. So I wanted to make a video reviewing the Lark water bottle because when I created my video about just receiving it, that wasn't actually a review. I wanted to just talk about uh, a purchase I made and it was just me talking through what the bottle did and I guess my first impressions. So now that it has been about seven months because I bought it in February, I guess the exact date is February 13th. And today is August 31st, Saturday. So I received a new Lark water bottle because recently I have noticed that there is a smell coming from the inside of the bottle, which is something they claimed would never happen if it was working properly. And I just noticed that gradually over time, I have been more reluctant to use a water bottle. Whereas before, you know, for the first five to seven months or until this problem started happening, I was really happy and excited to use the water bottle all the time because um, no smell and the water tasted fine. This is the first water bottle I got. I had it engraved with my Chinese name, Ting Hui, and it is still in pretty good condition. There are a few marks on the bottom, scrapes, most likely because I think I've dropped it once or twice. One time on concrete, which wasn't good, and it resulted in this dent right here. But overall, the more obvious areas of the bottle are in good condition. So I do like the construction of the bottle very much. I would say that the majority of the time that I've used it, I haven't had many problems with it. I've only had maybe two to three instances where I would press the cap once, for the regular cleaning. I would rarely use the adventure mode, which is double tapping and it takes a lot longer and it cleans harder. <laughs> but I started using that later on when it started to smell, thinking that that would help solve the problem, but it didn't. But anyways, there would be times where I would press it once and it would flash orange, which usually happens, I believe, when it's low on battery or if it thinks that you took the cap off while you're trying to use it. So. The instruction manual, I believe, discourages you from taking the cap off after you pressed it because it's cleaning and the way that the cap works is if it senses ambient light, it will shut off. So twice there were times where I was pressing it and it would flash orange and I would press it again, you know, a couple more times and it would still happen and then eventually it would work. So two to three times of that and then every other time that I've used it was basically perfect, which is fine. Um, I would say the duration of each charge also seemed to last pretty long. I never kept track precisely because it was never an issue for me. I would always just charge it to full whenever it would tell me that it's low, and then I would use it for a period long enough that I wouldn't ever think about how long was my last charge or, wow, this isn't lasting very long. So. Overall, I guess you can say that my experience with the bottle during that period of time was good. Oh, one second. I got interrupted last time while I was recording, so this is my second session sitting down. So to continue, while it was working, I suppose, I didn't really have any issues with it and I really enjoyed using it and I felt like it made um, drinking water that much easier. But yeah, basically for several weeks now, I've just been noticing that the smell has been persisting and at first I was thinking, oh, maybe it's the mouthpiece and maybe I need to clean it, but even afterwards it was still smelling, so I reached out to them. Let me just say that before this instance of reaching out to customer support, I reached out to them two times previously and I was pretty disappointed with their response times. It took them two weeks to respond to my messages the first two times and I feel like that is way, way too long for customer support. This third time, however, they responded within a day or two. That was very surprising. And then afterwards, it was pretty smooth sailing. They asked me to send them a video of whether the light in the cap was working. So I went into the bathroom where it was darker and I pressed it and I took the cap off. and. I saw that there was indeed a light there. And I did take a video of this, however, since the light was on, I didn't think I needed to send it because they did say if the light wasn't working, then it's under warranty and they would send me a new one. So even though the light was working, I told them that 
it's working is there anything else that could be the issue and they just said that the bottle must not be working properly so that they would send me a new one just like that I was pretty surprised that they decided to do that let me just show you guys in comparison essentially they look pretty much the same this is my original one and this is the new one both obviously the same color however they don't have the personalization on the newer one which does kind of suck but they did say I could move the cap on the new one over to my personalized one if I wanted to but of course since this one has dents in it and the new one doesn't most likely I'm gonna use a new one but something I did notice that was very interesting is that underneath the cap they changed the design of the light or at least the so this is what it looks like originally and this is what it looks like now from what I can tell this one is more exposed and this one is actually under some layer of plastic or something so maybe it protects it better and it does look slightly different it might be hard to tell just from me holding it up in the camera but I found that really interesting I guess I'm glad that they sent me a new bottle but a product like this I kind of view as a buy it for life type of bottle especially because it's nearly a hundred dollars so if it can't even last seven months I think without it possibly having issues I'm a little bit concerned about the longevity of this bottle because I don't find it likely that this company is going to consistently send me new bottles if it keeps going bad, right? So I suppose eventually later on down the line I might consider making another video if I have more issues with it. I guess my opinion is just that when it works I really do like it, but it really is dependent on how long this will last me. A bottle that is as expensive as this should be expected to last you years, I would like to think. Anyways, thanks for watching this review, and I do hope it helped you in some way. Make sure you drink plenty of water, and I'll see you in the next video.